Hi, welcome. My name is Homai, and in this video, we will be covering the basics of understanding a music staff. So a music staff is what music is written on. It's comprised of five lines. Here you can see we have one, two, three, four, five lines that comprise the staff, spelled S-T-A-F-F. -F. Now, on the staff, we can write notes. Notes usually just look like circles, like this. Now, sometimes the notes are going to be on the lines, like here you can see that the line of the staff crosses through the note, also crosses through this note, as well as this note. When you have notes that have a line crossing through the center of them, they are known as line notes. And when you have notes that exist between the lines or above or below the lines, these are known as space notes. Now the notes can be written either lower or they might be higher on the staff. The lower the notes are on the staff, the lower they will sound in pitch. Pitch is the highness and lowness of sound. So pitch tells us if a note size sounds higher or lower. Here's an example of a low sound on the piano. Here's an example of a high sound on the piano. Now, sometimes in music, we'll see two staves, staves is the word for staff that's plural, connected together by this symbol which is known as a brace. When you have two staves connected together by a brace, it creates what is known as a grand staff. Also, when you're reading music on a staff, we always read it left to right, just like you do when you read words. So we would read, sing, or play this note first, then this note, then this note, and then this note. So we're always reading left to right. Thank you for joining me for this video, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.